Hello and welcome. How are you doing? Next, I like to show you that that how we can check that are our cars or trucks this feel brakes in balance. And now we are meaning this in same axel that are these our brakes taking in same amount in this braking force and how we can test that in our home garage and in our backyard. First step is to do so that we need to lift up our car wheels up like in here and then second step is that we need some assistant who go to press in steady and same force in our braking pads first like little bit one inch or one, two centimeter press brake, brake pedal and then two, two inches like four centimeter braking press and then when we are pressing this our feel then we notice that now those uh, fields don't move anymore and then we need to have some measurement scale and I have here this measurement scale what is this uh, uh, measurement scale what can measure like 200 kilos this is like animal scale that we can when we hunt animals in in forest like like big big bear or bison bison or some other big animal that we can lift this animal up and then we can measure that how big lion or tiger we had in here and now we need like that kind of scale because next we need to insert that our scale in here into that field and when it is in position I start to pull that scale and then there is idea that when we look that scale amount in here that we must to get same amount in both sides in this like in this uh, front axle that in that wheel in left side and then this another right side feels there is same force when this brake starts to move and also this position position must be in this up area in same same place or then in down and in that way we can check that there must be similar amount of force when these brakes and feels start to move and this is like testing and we need to of course little bit uh, press weaker in brake pedal if there is no any movement but, but this test that we must have similar braking force in all our fields what are in the same axle okay and now I noticed that I can't uh, get this field to move because we have more too much force and that's I, I, I set up a little bit less force and my assistant press lower in this brake pedal next and we continue soon okay and now my assistant is pressing this brake pedal less and then I insert this my scale in here and I start to pull that my weight scale and, and in that force what is in here measurement scale and when this field start to move is this critical amount and now when I pull, pull there is 30 kilos and 35 and 40 and in 40 kilos it start to move okay and that means that 40 kilos is this this left front wheels uh, this force and then we go to check in this right area and we check that amount okay and now we are in right area and then I insert this my my fake scale in here and then we look at how much there is this force and it should be like 40 and let's leak look what is it is it is now 30 and, and in 40 it start to move okay and that means that now these amounts when they they were so similar that means that when there is 40 kilos that means that there is similar braking force and everything is fine and thank you for watching that video and this was this information 
that how to check my cars or trucks braking force.